was trying to look good. You're live. Hey, we're live. Yeah, we're live. Stop. Oh, stop. <laughs> Please. Please. It's hot in here. It is hot in here. That yeah. is, I agree with that. It is hot in here. Probably because you got them heat lamps. On yeah, on I'm sure. So. There's Nancy. Hello, Nancy. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think that heater says like 77 over there, that thermometer. You should have had some windows open. Well, I didn't want to open windows and then trying to heat the quail at the same time. That would be I don't, pointless. I don't Hello, Mimsy. <clears throat> Higgs. Anyway. <clears throat> hey, everybody. <laughs> We're just talking about how hot it is See, in here. I've got heat lights going on. on my quail, and it's heating up the house, and it's really hot in here. There's Gina, Gil. Hey, Gil. Camp Patton. So, um, nice here today. Well, you know, Higgs, I'm, but I'm they sitting here the multitasking tonight. A lot of sneezing. Yeah, it was nice here today. It rained this morning. I watch it about it sneezing. rained for like two days, and then it rained this morning till I don't know, um... Not noon. I think it quit before noon, but anyway. Mm. And then I finally was able to get out in the garden. Um, yeah, it wasn't quiet. <laughs> Terry needs a blue cup. <laughs> yes, I'm working on that. Yeah, we try and do all that. I've got two people down for it. I don't remember who. Anyway, he's one of I them. Everything. I got a couple people down that I need to try Whisper. to send. Turn from me. Huh? I haven't. Turn it back a little. Hi there, honey. <laughs> You're funny. Uh, let's see. He's, uh, Red Shed. Hello, Holly. There's Brenda. JNC's Oregon Homestead. Pop Truck. Uh, Rebecca Nichols. Um, Strong Enough to Bend. Shannon and Beverly. Homestead in Graving business and life. Hello, Sarah from Minnesota. Well, hello. There's Freaky Geek. Whoops, it's jumping. Uh, did I miss it all again? <laughs> no. No. No, we just getting started. We was just talking about how hot it is in here. I've got Ooh. the heat light going back there on the quail, baby quail. Who was it? Was talking uh, about the sneezing and stuff. Huh? Oh, well. Um, uh, Nancy at Ashes Treasure oh. yeah, said a mold and it got her flared up. Um, I ain't got no mold. Southern Ohio you what, prepping. The pollen's got me Day. all messed up. There's Bub. What's up? Tacos and burritos. <laughs> mm -hmm. Deb Rich. Hello. Nope, that's not rich. I can't read that. So it's got your eyes messed up too, huh? <laughs> Deb Rich. 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 Yeah, yeah. Rich. Uh, Ron. Hello, Ron. Ron. Say it. Say, uh, say that name. TNS Dogs and Dragonflies. Hello. For a few minutes, trying, still trying to get stuff done. Yeah, I understand that. There's Rachel, Garden for Cheap. Garden for cheap. Okay. <laughs> hey, Royalty. Well, Willie's not on here yet. Willie's the only one that calls us royalty. <laughs> <laughs> well, they said it. Um, Kathy, North Star Prep Stairs said, hey, royalty. Oh. I said, well, well they can call Willie's us that not day. on here. Well, yeah, but Willie's not on here. Okay. Uh, we had snow yet again today. This weather is wow. crazy. My goodness. Mm. There goes my eyes focusing. Well, some. we've had a lot of rain. Uh, saw you on Two Family Homestead. That was fun. We had a good time on yeah. Two Family, yes, we did. and um, the call-ins got a little crazy, but um, <laughs> it was really hard to hear. Something, a couple yeah. of them was really hard to hear. Um, 
it seemed like a couple of them was down too low and then a couple of them was up too high. So I, I, don't know. I could hear <laughs> on some of them. Anyway. Um, but yes, it was still fun. This morning. How is President Lee doing? I'm doing good. Besides allergies. Well, I'm tired. I am more war just smack dab out. I'm so tired. Six foot. Oh, stop. <laughs> I'm so tired. I didn't sleep good last night, and then I got up early this morning, and I've been going all day long full blast, and I'm just wore out. But we did get our rest of our garden planted. Yeah. We had some we pepper that. plants that we needed to get in and more tomato plants. <laughs> he took some tomato plants. Yeah, I, had, I, had, I, I had too many tomato plants started for us. And so he took some to work and was trying to give them away. I gave my daughter some, two of my friends some, and he took some to work. And they didn't take very many. And he brought nine back home. And I was like, oh. <laughs> I think I took 20. But we planted them. I think I took 28 of them to work. But we oh, went ahead and planted the some. nine, so we've got nine more. Yeah, I mean, they're, uh, they're I killed they're... a huge copperhead this week. Watch your step, folks. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Still ain't Trying actually found read. the copperhead here. Read, read, read. Okay. Okay. I know they um, can be, but I ain't found one yet. Rachel said, I wish I lived closer. I'd take some off your hands. I wished you did too then because yeah. I, I, I didn't want to just, I didn't know, you know, I didn't want to just get rid of them or anything, but yeah. nobody, we just couldn't give them away. So I, we went ahead he, and planted them. He has 12 tomatoes on one plant right now. <laughs> oh, goodness. Yeah, we're going to have a lot of tomatoes. Yeah. <clears throat> and we don't eat that many tomatoes. But, uh, I, he, I eat more than he does. He doesn't hardly eat tomatoes at all. Except Probably fried is green. In a different grow more because the frost got zone. my plants. Oh, so. uh, Gina said uh, trying to start more because the frost got my plants. Well, that's what um, yeah, we had. Some of them got ours. Yeah, too. it got some of ours, but then he brought these nine back home from work, and I was like, "We'll plant them." Um, if I'd have had time and thought about it, I'd have hollered at you, and I could have but met you halfway I or will brought say them to the. Yourself. The orange tomato, the orange tomato plants. It was a Amana orange. Yeah, they didn't. From uh, Baker's Creek. We started them from seed. I we mean, started all of ours from seed. a little bit of damage on yeah, the leaf they tips. They were hardy, very hardy. But it it's wasn't. It's called um, Amana with an A. Which Amana I did orange. cover them up. Very hardy. But still, even <laughs> after I covered all the other ones up, they just. Yeah, they wasn't no good. <laughs> so, uh, Ron yeah, they're said, definitely hardy. Ron said, uh, then don't grow them maters the green wizard while you'll have too many. Uh, yeah. yeah. Um, Ron has a um, Nutzel. I hope I say that right. Ron Nutzel, he has a book called The Green Wizard and uh, has lots of great information in that book. Uh, so how many, okay. So we, I think we ended up with 25. We had 22, then a few got killed during this frost surprise frost we had. Yeah. <clears throat> and then he brought nine back home. We ended up with 25. It was so, actually a surprise frost. I mean, and that's not we so definitely too many, but another frost, some people so. plant more than that, but we don't use them as much as a lot of people either because we don't hardly ever eat like spaghetti or salsa or, and he doesn't like no. tomatoes much except fried green. There's Mr. Willie. Mm. Uh, um, evidently Smith. I didn't see it, Mr. Willie. Nope. We got to go back evidently, up. I, I didn't, didn't see even you see come you come in. in. Yep. Somebody said hi to him. So let's go back and see if we can find that real quick. If not, he may have to do it again. Hmm. I don't see it, Mr. Willie. You may have to type I it again. I don't see it either. I see where somebody said hi to you, but I don't see yeah, your comment. It. It's okay. Here it is. 
is it okay for me to be here because I'm still have from last Friday roasting. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Willie. Yeah, uh, it is fine for you to be I've there. I've been trying to get him to make some videos on his channel for you. I said, you need to make Mr. Willie a video on your channel. I and tried, but it didn't. He uh, kind of done one, but it didn't work out too well for him. Mm -mm. Uh, love she was going to upload it, but then she decided not to. It was a little so. bad. If I could send it to you personally, I would. I got my book yesterday. Oh, good, good. Um, Move North Homestead uh, won a book on our live a couple of weeks ago. Mm -hmm. And she just got it. Let's see. What is the name of the other channel? Oh, Lee's channel is uh, Blue Cup. Oh, Mimsy put it. Blue Cup Adventures. Blue Cup Adventures. Mimsy put it the link there. Uh, let's see. Okay. Uh, Buddy and Lippy uh, made it through the storms, uh, I believe, fine. They had a little oh, yeah. damage if y'all uh, saw them earlier. They didn't come on at six because they were going to have more storms coming through. So they came on a couple hours earlier and uh, talked about the damage that they had from the last storm. So uh, y'all say a prayer for them. They had a lot of uh, structural damage to their house that's yeah. going to uh, be I was going to say they... Rough. They said that the storms was supposed they to said have been they were through and they was going to be on here tonight. Nice. They were on in. Mimsy's and said that they that everything was fine. They they oh, uh, okay. seemed like they, they came through the storm fine or something. Uh, a little bad, <laughs> yeah. Well, y'all just believe me. His video was not fit to be put on any channel on YouTube. So <laughs> we, he agreed. He agreed with me. I didn't veto yeah, it. I, I didn't I mean, veto well, it. That, he made the video and then he is like, I don't know if we should upload that or not. And I watched it and I said, eh, yeah. probably not. Sorry. Uh, I mean, there wasn't no said, bad like, language or anything like that. It was just. <laughs> A few too many blue cup, blue cup club drinks. Um, Carol at a fishes and loaves. I got my book too. And wow, I would love that victory garden. Awesome. Oh, Kathy. I saw Kathy somewhere. Hey, Kathy. Uh, let's see. Okay. It's going fast. Um, okay. If we're missing you, I'm sorry. It's going pretty fast. We can't keep up. Uh, there's Patty, the tinker's wife. She moved mountains, organic raw roots. Uh, sorry if I miss you. It's going kind of fast here. Uh, mm. Copper Kettle. There's uh, Crystal. Susan. Hey, Susan. Okay. Uh, let's move on here. Did I miss the new cup reveal? No, not yet. Give me just a minute. <laughs> Give me just a minute. Uh, let's see, Buddy and Lippy talked about Buddy and Lippy, and y'all say a prayer for them for their. They had uh, some structural damage in that last storm, so y'all please mm -hmm. say a prayer for them because they've got a lot of structural damage to their house. That's going to have a lot of work that they've got to do. There's uh, Patty and or Mac at Southern Blessed. Uh, one more thing, Pat. If you are not subscribed to Southern Blessed Homestead, no, Mike, he's probably in there taking selfies. <laughs> Southern I've Blessed Homestead is really, really close to a thousand. So if you are in this chat and you are not subscribed to Southern Blessed Homestead, please look yes, them please. up and subscribe to them. You can't subscribe the same way that you used to by clicking out beside the name. So you will probably have to remember it and wait and go back or open another. If you're on a computer, you can open another window and go subscribe. But uh, however you need to do it, please 
uh, subscribe to Southern Blessed Homestead. They are great people yeah. and they are so close to a thousand. Once you get to a thousand, you can video from your phone and all that stuff. And they would love to do that. So please uh, check them out. Okay. 963, she says. They're at 963. Mm -hmm. So they're real close, y'all. If you're not subscribed to them, please go do so. So, yeah, um, there there's uh, Johnny. I'm trying to read something. And I'm sorry. It's it's going fast, and I'm trying to let me describe. He's already subscribed. He's silly, bub. Uh, country homestead preacher. Okay. We well, start a new name, our bub, and <laughs> sub again. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. So. Here's I'm what sorry, happened. Mr. Willie, I was trying to read. <laughs> Most of y'all know that Lee has, ooh, it's heavy. Well, Lee know. has a blue cup club. It stays full. Because he was always drinking out of a blue cup on our lives. And Bub made some comments about his blue cup and said it's a club. Because I think maybe Bub had a blue cup one night too and said, yeah, we're, we're the blue cup club. So. It was kind of funny, and as a joke, I made so a some of these, and uh, we gave some of them out. We've still given some out. People still wanting them. It is actually, it's costing me like five, five, six dollars to mail them, so it's slow. I'm just having to mail them one or two at a time, because it costs five or six dollars just to mail them. That's beside buying them, and it doesn't cost me nothing to get the letters put on. My, my daughter's doing that for me. But, uh, you know, but and I bought a book of cups so that we could give them out, which we already went through all the blue ones. Mountain we got to get more blue ones. Truck. But <laughs> but uh, but yeah, it costs five or six dollars to mail them every time. And so that's why it's been slow. I don't mind doing it. We enjoy doing it. But it's been kind of slow getting one or two out at a time like that. So um, <clears throat> so. Okay, <laughs> yeah, uh, that must be Mac. Mac says, mine says Blue Cup Club. He was missing an E. <laughs> that is still something. Okay, I'm telling so. You, Mac, get you a so, white marker and put two little dots above the blue. Or and the Michelle e. said, do not put them in the dishwasher. Yeah, um, Miss Lippy <laughs> yeah. ruined buddies <laughs> put in the dishwasher. Yeah. But anyway, so we don't have a dishwasher, so we never thought about saying that we wash everything by hand yeah. anyway uh so um <clears throat> here we go so then all the ladies were like oh we need a cup club Lisa and says, i threw well, around pay, different pay um, you the shipping and costs that would be fine if anybody wants to pay for it i'll go ahead and get it out uh but if not i will still um um, get them out there. Ten dollars toward the cup. To some that oh, have asked, you, and Shep. I'll have to keep taking names down. I've got a whole list right now, so I'm gonna keep taking names yeah. down. But anyway, this is for the females. This is for the ladies. Um, I don't like it. <laughs> you don't like it? Don't say that. No. <laughs> you don't. Women always got it took me forever to figure them. out what I wanted to say for the ladies cup club. Oh, I and, like the um, saying on it. I just don't like it. Okay. Y'all's is well, us <laughs> men are more <laughs> laid already. back and so it is not pink camo. I'm sorry. Well, everybody okay. threw ideas around and I just couldn't decide on anything. So my daughter decided for me. One of my daughters, um, actually three of my daughters have a cricket, uh, but one of them that has a cricket came up with this and I liked it and I was happy with it. So I was like, okay, that's what we'll do. And so if y'all are ready for the big reveal. The big reveal. <laughs> I hope it shows up with the light and the camera. I hope it shows up. Well, okay. Sure. I, I bought a bunch of white cups. I bought white cups because I wasn't sure what I wanted to do. And I couldn't find the right pink. The pink I found was like a baby pink, and I didn't like it. Um, ladies need a pink cup club. Well, we thought about that. I never did really mm. like the pink cup club as much, and I couldn't find the right pink cup. 
Anyway, I'm sorry. This is Bugs what you got. You shouldn't have worms either. <laughs> I like it. Chickens. All right, here we go. Oh, it's not showing up. There it is. Cluck, cluck, club. Cluck, cluck, club. <laughs> I like and it. Man, That's easier it. Easier to just say the three cluck, C's. Cluck, club. And it matches the blue. It matches the blue cups. So that's what we got. And it's got a blue bandana. And the blue, it doesn't look like it on it here. It looks but like turquoise. The blue matches. No, it looks like it on there. It looks like turquoise, but it's not. It's the same blue as the blue cup. Now, and then she put Stringfield Ridge Farm on the back of mine. So we may do that on all of them, but. I, I'm not sure about that, but this is what you'll get. Club, club, club. For the hens. For all of us hens. Okay, that's mm. it. <laughs> I hope y'all like it. Um, right. So, anyway. Likes it. Ashley Treasure likes it. Uh, so, Brenda yeah, I'll be it. taking names. I've got a whole list of names already. So, in uh, Gina, Gina HT, she already sent money for her shipping and so i'm gonna get hers out right away and somebody the red shed uh sent uh let's see i'm not sure i have her down i'm not real sure i may i have a whole list already y'all so let me get that down it's holly and uh, so i'll start getting those out as soon as i can and um I hope y'all like them. Anyway, that's it. <laughs> and no, I've got I'm a couple for him. Like I've got to get out uh, two, two, uh, I think, two or three uh, blue cups. We got to get out. And then these Max will start. Saying, get the cluck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. One more time. Cluck, cluck, club. And the hen has on a blue bandana. And this blue matches his blue cup. It really See, doesn't. I don't know why they look couldn't like come it on up here, with... but it does. Something like that. It's the for same the blue, blue as his club. cup. It looks but, turquoise. I don't know why. Oh, there we go. Closer. There we go. It's the same blue as his cup. No, yeah, it is. Look. No, it is. Mine's a little darker. Shut up. You would argue with the brain. You don't. Okay. We got <laughs> you don't know my blue. There's Buddy. Hey, Buddy. Uh, let's see. We've missed a lot. I'm so sorry. That would be easy. Miss well, buddy, did Lippy miss that <laughs> cup? Um, I bet Lippy missed the reveal on that cup. Love it. Okay. All right. And uh, so thank you, uh, Holly, at the Red Shed. I'll get yours right out and Gina's right out. And maybe I can go ahead and get a few more out. Uh, from there, and uh, then I'll get them out two or three at a time as I can. So, um, no, I'm not jealous, Kathy. <laughs> uh, I just don't know why us men always have to settle for playing. John Goff is on the list, and anyway, just uh, so what? What did I miss? Sounds like Lee is jealous. <laughs> Men are a bit colorblind some of the time. It did look kind of turquoise when I had it back, but when you get it up close, you can tell that it's the same color. No, I'm RT. <clears throat> I know colors. Knife possible for July, Lee. Well, I'm I'm definitely trying. Um, he's supposed to be making uh, several knives. He's supposed to be making several. Your second, uh, Rachel. At Garden for Cheap is supposed to get one, and then you, and then he's after that he's got four or five more. Yeah, but your second I mean, on things just is so not been working out. Yeah, since he's had a real hard time with that. January with brains and July. July is a while off. He would try. I I wish the river would fall out so that he can get Flint. Uh, okay, thank you, Rachel. That gotcha. or it, it'd stop raining long enough that I could heat treat some of this. You're probably and I already do have. There, but I'll put you down just in case you're not. So I, I got to find the list. Uh, never settle. 
unless it's with hot get... chocolate and marshmallows. Oh. Teresa don't mm. like hot chocolate and marshmallows. It's a curse. I'm trying to read some of this. Okay. I think we're at the yep. end. Got service. Buddy said, I missed the cup. Oh, Lippy missed the cup. All right. All right. One more time. Well, that's good. That's good. Hey. Is it mine? Here we go. Hopefully Mine's I can dirty. get a few okay. good pieces out. Make a few blades anyway. There you go, Miss Lippy. It's the same blue as the Blue Cup Club. Cluck, cluck, club. And it's got a blue bandana. For the hens, my daughter came up with this. And I liked it. So I was like, yep, that's what we'll do. And it's the same blue as the Blue Cups. <clears throat> so that's it. It's settled. That's it. Should have been a red bandana. And that been Bobby McGee. President Lee is never jealous because he is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Oh, goodness. Oh, thank you, Brenda. Wow. Brenda just supplied five people with cups. <laughs> uh, Brenda, I know you're on the list, but I'm going to write you down just because I, I don't see the list at this moment. And uh, that will take care of four cups. So I will get on my list. I, we, I started a list like two weeks ago when I mentioned it and we were talking about it and people start saying and I start writing down names. So I'll have to go back to that list and get through it. And then I'll take some more. Uh, Brenda. And I'll have to get addresses. If you want a cup. Um, please be sure you email me your address unless you think I already have it. Please go to my email and email me your address so I can get those out. Uh, why don't you don't land on a list that gets you written up? <laughs> it's possible. Um, please add me to the list. Let's see, Rebecca Nichols. Be sure that you email me your address. I know I don't have yours. I have a few addresses. If I've mailed you anything real recently, I should have your address. But No, you wouldn't. Oh, well, you thank would, you, Lippy. Well, you, you, I know you on the list. <laughs> you was helping me come up with ideas. <laughs> I know you on the list. Oh, um, move north. I have Alpha your address. New grandbaby. He's doing good. Doing good, yep. She, oh. um. Well, I don't know as much of what she does. Oh, he's doing good. The mama, on the other hand, has not gotten her unemployment yet, has not gotten her stimulus check yet. Now her truck's broke down. Poor thing. She's always, it's always something. Mm. And I just hate it. She just told me a while ago that she still hadn't gotten her unemployment. She still hadn't gotten her stimulus and uh, and her trucks broke down. So say a prayer for my daughter. Her name is Jennifer and this is Palin's mama. And Palin, I wanted Palin to be here tonight and wear her cowboy. It's still here. Little P, I ain't going I there kept it here. I kept her outfit here because I wanted her to wear it tonight. And be on here, but she ended up going to her daddy's. So, um, I hope you're reading because I'm right. I could go. Well, I, I've seen something. I Thank you, up. Patty. I could say some stuff on that. Would really embarrass you, but <laughs> uh, Patty, I'll mail you a cup and that, I'll put an so. extra E in there for <laughs> Max Cup. <laughs> <laughs> you better watch it. You had better watch it, buddy. I said a cock a doodle doo. Uh, yeah, I, I saw Rachel's. I got Rachel's. Uh, Carol, I got Rachel's name on there. I saw that and. Uh, I, I said something. I hope she heard me. I saw Rachel's and said, I got you on there. 
Thank y'all so much. Um, this will get lots of cups out. <laughs> we'll get lots of cups out. Um, there's Royal Amethyst Acres. Hello. Uh, Eli, single man. Hope I'm not missing anybody. Uh, Holmes, oh, I already said that one. Okay. We're back to the bottom. Uh, I have not got my check yet. We, well, I mean, we hadn't either, but we wasn't expecting to. We're supposed to get ours like May twenty second or something. We'll get a Sorry check. Sorry about we'll that, get a, Papa. What? Definitely. What? Mama Z said, "Please keep Papa in your prayers." Aw. He just found out. Lost a best lost friend one tonight. Aw. Yeah, we'll say prayer for him. Ooh, that jumped. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Every once in a while, it just jumps up and you can't find where you were reading at. Uh, okay. How do I get a cup? Okay. Sunny's Place. Um, I am so sorry, but I don't know uh, if you need a, I don't, I, I haven't really seen your, I don't know who this is to know if you want a blue cup or a cluck cup. So if you tell me and email me your information, we, oh, you'll, I'll get you one. I'm putting you on the list. Sunny's Place. Move more homestead. Okay. Uh, we'll do sorry. Let's see. Friday is too busy. God bless all. Um, let's see. Whoa, that jumped. Mm, yeah. Put duct tape on the lips of my cluck cluck chicken. <laughs> cluck chicken. Cluck cluck chicken. Oh. Oh, man. Uh, mm -hmm. Let's see. I'm trying to read on down through here, y'all. Um, Buddy, was that you? Cluck <laughs> <laughs> uh -uh. <coughs> cups rule. I like her blue bandana. I thought that was pretty pretty cool. And that it that the blue matches the blue cups was was good. And so I was like, "Yep, that'll work. That'll do it." Uh, I just couldn't decide. I was so indecisive about it that somebody had to decide for me and just do it. <laughs> Um. Actually, yeah, I think we did send Buddy. But yeah, in. Buddy got a new cup. Yeah. We couldn't find these same cups again. We ended up having to go with a cheaper, um, uh, not insulated cup. Yeah. These the original cups were insulated and really nice. But I got them mm -hmm. at the dollar store on sale, like end of the year, end and of that's the summer. Why when they went in the for fifty dishwasher. cents dishwasher. They didn't. Well, but they, but they, they, they were like, they were like three dollars, and then they had them marked down to fifty cents. And I went ahead and bought all of them, and there was like twenty of them, and we gave those out at the picnic last year, mm -hmm. and um, so then some more people wanted them, yeah. and I couldn't find them. Couldn't find them nowhere. They, they were out of be, stock, uh, out of stock. So I ended up getting these kind. So the blue cups I've sent out now are just these um, stadium. They're called stadium cups. Yeah. I didn't know it was going to be a big fad. <laughs> Someone suggested earlier that Lee needs a rooster on his cup. <laughs> Love the blue on the cups. Yeah. And it matches my blue Dodgers hat. <laughs> That's cool. Um, so, yep, email me your um, mailing address and everything. Um, let's see. I'm trying to catch up here. Whoa. Since Bub milks rabbits, you need to get him a really small cup like a Dixie cup. <laughs> um, Bub dropped his and what? broke it. I don't know how he done that. I think he landed on it. He dropped it and uh, broke yeah, it. Yeah, I believe. And we had to send him another one. Any more future vlogs on taking care of chickens? I got two last week. and wanting info on how many times to change their water each day we now if you're talking about grown chickens we don't change their water we just mm -hmm. uh when it when it gets pretty empty 
we will dump it out, wash it out a little bit, fill it back up. That's all we do. We don't really change right. them well, out we until it's big. Yeah, we got a great big one. But right. uh, we don't really change it out. We just wait until it's almost empty and then we wash it out, fill it back up. Uh, now, the babies, I have baby quail back here with the heat light on them. Um, hatched out six. One of them didn't make it, so I have five. But the five are doing great. I mean, they're running around and eating and drinking. And uh, if their water gets slimy or anything, I would probably go ahead and clean that out just because they're At babies. Least probably a couple of days. Yeah. Every couple of days, I'll probably clean that yeah. out just because they're babies. But the big chickens out in the coop, I just don't. We just don't. We just no, I mean, fill it they, back up when it gets. I mean, out there. The things that they eat, <laughs> I mean, um, a little bit of dirty water ain't going to hurt them I was either. talking to Linda Yu, and she said he was taking a break. Okay, uh, let's see. Talking about Pete's Little Homestead, is that who y'all are talking about? I know he's kind of the same said thing. that. He said his laptop was messed up and something else. His laptop was messed up, and he had um, something, a toothache or i can't remember i'm so sorry a, a toothache or something i can't remember what it was not mm -hmm. feeling well let's put it that way he was not feeling well and um he was going to take a little bit of a break and his, well and his laptop was down too so um at least that there's the last mm -hmm. bit Okay, I um, that he said. Dawn, if you will email me your address, please, we will get, get you on there. But you probably need to email me that address. And um, I'm sure my email is probably on here. And if not, it's in my description of my videos and stuff. Uh, they are laying hens, but they poop in it. So I've been doing all this work for nothing. We we don't. I, we I, don't. I don't know if anybody else does, but we don't. We just wait till it's almost empty. I've seen them go back around and eat each other's poop. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't want to know that. <laughs> well, I mean, they do. Chicken will eat anything. I mean, it's. Uh, we just had a hen to hatch out five, maybe more. I really awesome. Wouldn't. That's awesome. Uh, we've got a hen that's trying to sit. I don't know if she'll hatch any Which, out. Which, I mean, we trying. usually let ours free range anyway, just lock them up at night. So, do we don't. Send you an email. Thank you. Um, so, I guess there's Dee Dee Bell. Hello, Dee Dee Bell. Yeah, you probably need to clean uh, the water more okay, often. Okay, Rebecca. What's that noise? You better see what that is. Did the chickens are locked up? Yeah, the chickens are locked up. Is the dog in the house? Yeah, she's right there. I don't know what that was. That was weird. We got some weird noise going outside. Sorry, y'all. It almost sounded like a hurt dog or something. Yeah, I know. Okay, flashlight? sorry, y'all. Uh, the flashlight is over on the incubator. Sorry, y'all. We got to check that out. That's not normal around here. We had a yelping dog sound outside. Um, okay. Never know what Lee's going to say. You got that right. <laughs> you don't want folks you don't know sending you things. Um Oh, no, never physical email address. Okay, let's see. I'm trying to read down through here. President Lee, First Lady Teresa. <laughs> uh, I thought one of my hens was broody, but when I checked yesterday, she wasn't on the eggs. I went out this evening to get the eggs, and she was sitting on the eggs. Um, ours kind of done that, too. I, I'm letting her sit. I moved them to a different spot, which she was fine with. And she's set on them. Uh, we have we have like six boxes right beside each other. And she had them in the one that everybody lays in. 
So I moved them over in hopes that she would get over there because I, she was kind of the same way. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna let you sit on them. But if you're going to get up and down and up and down, they're not going to, they're going to end up rotting. And so I don't know, we'll see, but I'm letting her sit on them. She just keeps getting up. And usually they really don't do that a whole lot, but she'll sit on them all day long and then get up and go for 30 minutes. And then go back and sit on them. I'm like, that's eh, not really right, I don't think. Um, let's see. Let me catch up with the chat here. Lee forgot the gun. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you were kidding. I was like, is the gun in here? <laughs> I didn't know the gun was here. Um, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, I was thinking the same thing. Teresa, I love your hair. Oh, thank you. It's getting pretty long again, and I can just wrap it up and throw it up in a... <clears throat> Can't remember how old they are. Can I have my fish? <laughs> they have four boxes, but they all like to lay in the same box. So if she's still on them tomorrow... Yeah, that's what ours do. They all lay in the one box. So since she was trying to sit on them, I moved them so that everybody could still lay in their box they like, and she can do whatever. We've been wanting to hatch some eggs if she wants to hatch them. Yeah. Lee's going to make the bang sound of a gun to scare the whatever it is away. <laughs> somebody, uh -oh. said, somebody said you forgot the gun. And Freaky Geek said, Lee's going to make the bang right. sound of a gun to scare the whatever it is away. <laughs> no, hey. <laughs> uh, I probably just need to take a video out there. What is it? Darn cats out there. You know how um, they are? They breed constantly. Uh, it sounded like it, a dog. Well, I know, but I just went out there and they was going, <laughs> wow. Sounding like a dog this time. I believe I can make some videos and get rich off of the cat house <laughs> no. video. Waiting on Mac to finish the coop so we can get our chickens. That, That's then I heard awesome. A, then I heard a chupacabra down there. Yeah. Yeah. Heard one of them. <laughs> and then there was a. Yeah, our cats are like, you always hear cats out here fighting and carrying on, but that sounded like a dog, not a cat. So. Uh, I was going to say something about making, marking his territory, but the words would not come at that moment. <laughs> well, I marked it after. Cat, ma so. cat mating ventri ventriloquism. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, they made a dog sound. I don't know. That's weird. It, um, it did, actually. Okay. Uh, good night. Mood North Homestead. Good night. We'll talk I'm pretty to you sure I heard a jackalope too. Cats make too, all kinds of weird sounds. Okay. I'm um, not quite sure. What is he doing? Thought I heard a jackalope. Hmm. Who? A message popped up. I was like, what is he doing? Oh. Uh, how about those frogs that a can cry like kitty cats? The what? Frogs that can cry like kitty cats. <laughs> we used to, I don't know, uh, but I, I've had a few of them in the bag that <clears> they'd sit there and you'd be taking them back videos. and they'd, they'd be sitting there going, oh, I'll walk, I'll walk. I said, no, I've already carried you this far. You ain't walking now. <laughs> so. um, we used to live by somebody that had a um, peacock. When I was growing up. Yeah, they are crazy. And it <laughs> sounded, that peacock would sound like a woman screaming. I don't want to have that. That was a freaky sound. Uh, yeah, if you would <laughs> like <laughs> to send us this note. Uh, well, don't drink it all at one time, there, bub. Got, I got four ounces of rabbit milk today, tonight. Uh, let's see. Okay. Boy, I, they scream, I, help, help, help. It, it really, I'd make that was a freaky that, sound. It always sounded like a woman screaming for help, and that was just crazy. 
I don't know if anybody else that has peacocks has ever heard that, but well, big cats or the little ones. Little ones are, yeah, little ones. That's Paul. Hi, Paul. Wait, um, wait till there's a big cat I around that screams out. The bushes it sounds hospital like a woman yelling, right. Turned out it was a frog. Wow. Hmm. Need some ice cream. Well, Brenda, <laughs> call Nancy Pelosi. she got all kinds of ice cream. Um, <laughs> well, I mean, hell, she wants to put it out there like that. Peacocks say help and gale. <laughs> we had peacocks for a while and they are noisy and crap on everything. Yeah, about like a guinea. Uh, let's see. We had guineas at one time. We had, how many did we have? I don't remember. Two. Two? And the hawk got one and then but we it, wound but it, up with one. But it would be out here screaming loud. And I was like, yeah. I can't handle that. That It unnerved me. It so kept I me unnerved. Told, I finally told my uncle, I said, here, Merry Christmas. <laughs> and Brenda said, it. see if I say poor poor Lee again. <laughs> <laughs> is that what Pelosi is prepping with? Ice cream? Yeah. I think so. Yeah. Peacocks just scream. Don't know if else. they say words. Had one fella follow me around one summer while doing yard work in Newfoundland. <laughs> uh, mm. Love the roof of the house. So I don't know what that meant. Um, so up in those claws. Okay. Just trying to read everything, get everything in. I milked at a dairy in Colorado in the 70s, and they had over 100 peacocks. Wow. Wow. I would have went star crazy. <laughs> uh, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. Thank you. Higgs, if you go on over into Aurora over there, there's Still a have peacock feathers running from around. Them. Oh, peacocks will get on your roof. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Poor, poor President Lee. I know. Whatever. No. <laughs> okay. I get Let mistreated all the time. Look. Okay. Let's see if I got everything we want to talk about in. Next week, next week. We are thinking about doing uh, our live out on our screened in porch out there. I think we're going to do that just for the heck of it, just for something different. We're going to, if, if the weather's good, if the weather's good and it's not uh, dipping down in the cold, which I don't think it's going to, we're supposed to be clear from Pretty here standard. on. But we're going to do out here in this porch, okay. this is a screened in porch that we're going to uh, try to do our live from. I would. Next week is it? What? I don't know what. Um, hmm. What? Rachel said I would. I'm not sure what she was talking about. Probably on the porch. Next week is the end of the month. Fancy. <laughs> um, end of the month. Schedule. Uh, yeah, she was up there running got around. Got projection schedule for the next gone. two Mondays. Uh, gotta go set up. Yeah. Uh, okay, Gil. Uh, Gil, if I don't make it, I'm sorry. I'm so smack dab wore out. I'm thinking about taking a shower and going to bed. I, I'm. If I'm, I'll try to come on there. But if if I don't, I'm sorry. <laughs> well, Higgs, did you end up shooting on the peacocks and eating them? We oh, yeah. I'm wondering what what they tasted like. Do your live from the porch. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I think that'd be cool. Just something different, you know, just to do something different and be on the porch. I love sitting on that screen in porch. Yeah, she is always beating on me there. Especially Mr. like in the morning, drink a cup of coffee on the screen in porch. I love it. Don't see too many wild turkeys here, but wow, they sure are <laughs> nice when you do see them. <laughs> I'll tell y'all a story about that porch out there. I was out there one day and I had me a popsicle. And I was eating it. <laughs> this Good is night. no lie. I was out there. I was eating me a popsicle, and I had a brain freeze. And I was sitting there, and I, I bent over, and I was holding my breath because oh, I was trying to get the brain freeze to stop. And I had a cigarette in one hand too. And next thing I knew, I woke up, 
and I was on the floor out there, and she's like, what's wrong with you? You all right? What happened? What happened? I was like, what's this woman talking about? You know, and then I realized I'm laying on on the floor out there. I'm like, I guess I passed out. I don't know. And she's like, have you got that sinus problem thing going on again? I'm like, he had a sinus infection no. and he was sitting there eating a cold and, popsicle and it done something. It and made it, him pass plumb out. Oh, it, yeah, it made me pass out. Yeah. She's like, my goodness, it, this is crazy. You passed out from a brain freeze. I ain't never heard of that before. <laughs> and I said, well, it was a pina colada popsicle I was eating, so <laughs> I don't know. But then she took my popsicle away from me and threw it out the door. That pissed me off. Ron said, keep her cast iron out there, lady? No. <laughs> <laughs> but it did happen. But it, it, Well, I was sitting here at the kitchen table, so I kind of saw it all. It was like, boom, and I looked, and he was, on the porch, no, laid out. I, and I, like, I didn't. I didn't wet myself. Eh? <laughs> was it a cigarette? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was a cigarette. <laughs> uh, Crystal said, "How's the baby doing? They're doing good. Um, <laughs> the baby's doing great. The mom, on the other hand, is a little frustrated. She hadn't. She's laid off and applied for <laughs> unemployment. She hadn't got any unemployment yet. She hadn't got any." Um, Stimulus hey, check yet yeah, or anything, it, and now our trucks broke fruit down. Fruit jars before there too. Heads. You know, <laughs> that's happened to me with fruit jars. Oh, <laughs> never a popsicle. All <laughs> kinds of other <laughs> drinking devices, but yeah, that's the first and only Passing time with a like popsicle. That. Yeah, they did. <laughs> I mean, it dropped me like a hot cake. Sure did. Um. Yeah, and he passed out in here one day. Didn't you pass out here in the living room? That was the first time. I passed out in here twice. From a sinus infection. He had a bad sinus infection. He has bad sinuses shower. anyway. But now he's done way, way better with that. Uh, yeah. We started doing the essential oils, and he found three essential oils that help with that, and he has not done that again since then. And he breathes these essential yeah. oils. What are they? I Tell mean, the three. Not Knock on wood, oh. the last time I had a bad sinus infection was the first year we went to Deep South, which was yeah three years ago. And since then, and we've since been doing then, these been three doing essential my, oils that he have helped him Cinnamon, a lot. clove, and thyme. Cinnamon, clove, and thyme. Mm -hmm. And he puts them in a little pot and, and some water and heats it up and breathes the steam. And we put we also put it in the uh, diffuser in the bedroom at night, mm -hmm. and he has not had hardly any problems since then. He still has some Don, sinus, but well, yeah, I mean, not I still like that. Sinus, not bad sinus infections blowing out, but it don't clog everything. Uh, up. Plans for the picnic? Maybe. Francine's asking about hot mustard. I'll pass out. Well, <laughs> don't come around me with cantaloupe because I'll throw up. Um. Miss Francine is asked about the picnic. Cantaloupe. That was another thing on For my list. Reason. The picnic is September 12th at Grand Rivers, Kentucky. Yep, same place it was. Potluck lunch, uh, potluck lunch. Uh, if you want to follow along and keep up with the details and as we get them, uh, we'll be on Heartland Homesteaders facebook page and we really haven't done a whole lot of planning yet i i, I, I was planning on starting oh, to plan yeah. with the other major folks, migraines uh that are helping uh in may so in may we'll start doing more planning and we'll put our plans on the heartland homesteaders facebook page so um but as I, we plan on having it unless for some reason this crazy crap keeps going and, and we can't. The only way we're not going to have it is if they shut the park down and tell us we can't come. But it's at Little Lake Park in Grand Rivers, Kentucky. And there's several motels there. There's also a lot of camping 
spots there. It's on Kentucky Lake. So there's a lot of camping spots. spots. I don't think they can take us all in. (laughs) I believe I can take half of them all in damn self. Whatever. Oh, no. Now he's 10 foot tall and bulletproof. That Mississippi heat and humidity gives well, all of us side to side. If they yeah. say we can't have it at a park, by God, um, we can go somewhere he's else and have it. on migraines in me. Mm. Yeah, he has. He gets bad side. Used to get bad side effects. I mean, I still got. He still has some sinus. I mean, I still have sinus a issues. A little bit, but, but not near as bad. I mean, uh, like anyway, right now, um, I've got some sinus pressure and stuff. But I it's also not. don't like cantaloupe for some reason. Everyone else I know does, though. Yeah, he can't stand the smell well, of I it. I can't. He mm. will gag yeah. every time. I gag hell. thought you were going to say you my stomach. Mm. tried to eat your cigarettes. <laughs> I can no. for computer, computer lose. I, yeah. On the videos. Mm. They need 40 friends. I'm not sure what he's talking about. They need 40 friends. I can four computers. I'm not sure. Okay. Mm, Pass that. I'm not sure the exact amount of watch hours we need, but it is a couple thousand at least. Hmm. So the thing with Southern Bless, though, is uh, they're close to their thousand subscribers. And if they can get there, then they can uh, video or uh, go live from their phone, their cell phone and stuff. And uh, it just frees mm-hmm. you up a little uh, more to do things with your cell phone instead of, you know, uh, just videos and, and having to do lives on your computer. So, uh, you know, then once you get to the thousand, you can really work hard on those uh, hours. And uh, live, oh, live streams yeah. really help the hours a lot. They gotta open um, up the bar. I got a field if they shut us down. <laughs> there you go, Higgs. Higgs said he has a field if they shut us down. There you go. He um he doesn't live far from there. We had such a wonderful you better time. Fence so off him bluffs, so uh, I'm starting to look like George Washington now. Don't call yeah. it cantaloupe, call it cantaloupe. <laughs> Oh, let's see. I'm missing some stuff. Oh, your hair is looking mighty cute. Oh, thank you. I like it's you getting longer, and I can just pin it up now. I, I, I was sitting here like talking about me looking like George Washington. Mm-hmm. I think it was my hair. Oh, oh, we got to go, y'all. We got to go. Um, Camp Patton Gill mm-hmm. at Camp Patton Family Compound is fixing to come on. 40 friends, and I'll hammer the watch hours with four computers. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Okay. That's awesome. Uh, living miracle. You can put honey on any melons. <laughs> uh, good. Let's no. say good night. Good night. Okay. Everybody's starting to say good night and Camp Patton is fixing, fixing to come on. So, um, garden for cheap. I'll start running your channel. That's awesome. I miss, I have 19, 20 hours. Um, yep. Yeah. We all need to uh, help each other out, you know, Um, any we can. Any you can run somebody's channel and give them some watch time. Well, a few more years, and and, uh, if you're not subscribed, hit them up. Probably going to be about white. Two minutes. We got two minutes. I know you can't really see it in there, but that's what all that light color is in there. It's all gray. Thanks again for my winning book. It ain't like Teresa's. You're they welcome, Carol. Stick out like a sword. Take care, time. folks. Get to growing something. Yep. Uh, let's see. Boy, I'll have to save the rest of my stuff on my list for next week. All right. And we will start getting these cups mailed out. I had cabin fever and cut my own bangs. Uh-oh. <laughs> I, I'm thinking love. about doing one of them be He's like dumb and dumber, just promotion. cut it off we right up here Patty and to come down 1, and cut it off again. Shayla to 1,000, Nathan to his 4,000. Yep. That was awesome, Crystal. Crystal done a wonderful job mm-hmm. getting all that. And she got us to the 2,000. Helped. She mentioned mm-hmm. us several times. Uh, okay. And she wants cup. I think I already have you down, uh, Crystal, but I will put you down just in case I don't. 
Okay. And I'll start getting out cups as soon as I can. I'm going to hit the ones that uh, gave some money and some of them gave extra. So, you know, I'll start getting those out right away. And uh, hopefully, and then as soon as I can get all the ones out I've already got down, we'll get some more names. All right. What? 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 Do it, Lee, but get the Jim Carrey the team. Green. Good night, everyone. Thanks for the friend's help yeah. to get me off the dreaded. <laughs> yeah. Right All right. There, let's uh, go watch Camp Patton. Um, I might try to get in there a little bit with him, but, man, I am so wore down. I am going to go take a shower, and then I'll try to watch a little bit before I just pass out. <laughs> love y'all. We love y'all. Thank you so much. And uh, we'll see y'all next week. We're working on some videos, but we can't get enough video done to put a whole video up. We've put bits and pieces of things, but mm -hmm. nothing to do a whole video on. Yep. All right. We love y'all. Thank you so much. All right. Catch y'all later. I hit Whoa. it. It didn't end. There it goes. Same.